Sudhir Indi, President of this function. Now, other friends, Sudhir please. All on the dais, off the dais. Today, we are all very happy to continue this happiness. All these days, why this region's people are fighting, we all know. Because this region is backward, backward, it's been ignored. But today, what we have been going to face, the new challenges are too many. Just now, it will speak as how they explained. Apart from the bill, apart from the bill of Telangana, there's a lot of announcements made by Prime Minister in the Parliament. We are, we are all aware of it. If that kind of disparity is going to take place, it is highly difficult to develop this region. I know fully well. The tax holiday or special status for the region, Sivandra, whatever, is welcome. But this region leadership also should fight for it to keep the equal status. Otherwise, we all know in the South India, only about the Andhra Pradesh. In the entire South India, if the particular area is going to be the special incentive region, naturally all industry will go to that particular region. Therefore, it is the time to understand all the visionaries of the state, and particularly all these days we have been fighting for the backwardness. This backwardness will go further. We feel regret of having the state. I am clear in my view, therefore I request all the statesmen and leadership of this region should fight it for the equal status at least. In fact, this leadership would have been fighting a better, better package. The region being all these years it has been neglected. And we have been discussing about the revenue matters. Revenue dynamics, revenue dynamics will change within a couple of years. Because a lot of that, whichever sales will take place in that region, will go. I don't know how this calculation has been made, but the gap I don't expect. There is much gap in between the respective states. Therefore, I request once again to have a very friendly industrial atmosphere in the state going to having in the new state. We all need to work togetherness, particularly the rural side, the government side, and the industry should get it hand in hand and demand at the national leadership your maybe the power for the concession concessions or special status, what is our friendly state is going to have it. Therefore I Emphasizely request all the leadership of this region to fight it enormously with single voice. And also, we all know since few years there is a lot of uncertainty in the state. With this clarity, I hope it is a time to all of us, particularly, we stopped working the government sector or private sector showing this confusion. Now we have to rededicate to ourselves for all hard work and sharing of the information and debottlenecking of the all regulations from the government particularly. For any small things, we need to fight with the government. That should not happen. It should be a very friendly state. Hurdles has to be taken out. Dr. Vivek is apart from the politician, is also a successful industrialist. I welcome him on the guys. <laughs> Therefore, Mr. Vivek, as a politician and as an industrialist, I hope you will understand much better what needs to this state. If Mr. Vivek also, if Sibandra is given as a special status and uh, the Telangana region is, uh, is not being given, 
Do we want to set up the industry in Simandra on? <laughs> because we need to understand this very, very carefully. All this, why I'm mentioning, apart from the act, there's a lot of mentions by the Prime Minister. I appreciate the leadership of the region for striving, a lot of announcement from the Prime Minister. But this is all going to be have a lot of impact on the industrial sector. One need to understand. Therefore, <clears throat> apart from all the section of the people and party, we have to be very vigilant and we have to get the equal benefits to this region. And apart from this, of course, after the new government formation, maybe any, any government, it has to be very friendly government towards the industry. Because our uh, Telangana state youth is expecting that overnight everything that happens if state comes. It's not so easy. We need to really work hard and give the lot of infrastructure facilities for the industry and the industrial atmosphere and good governance. And as earlier speakers mentioned, we are going to be a lot of deficit for, for immediate requirement, for short term and for long term, we need to really think into these lives. With this, I request all of industries and the government should go hand in hand. Thank you, Madam.